the third time just this series that the Grizzlies overcame a double digit deficit in the fourth quarter. Three of their four wins in this series came. <laughs> You're laughing, but they were behind by at least 10 in the fourth. I'm shaking my head because you were at home in game six of the playoffs and you give up 40 <laughs> points. And you think about this, it's like, Ja is the star of this team. He didn't really have a good game. He had 17 points, but a lot of those got at the free throw line. And so, to me, the coaching staff and the organization have to take a really good look at themselves, meaning, that, meaning Minnesota says, we have to play smarter down the stretch. We can't give up buckets like this because they were they were exposed defensively for not what you say three times three three games. Oh yeah, three the, of four wins in the fourth quarter. Okay. That just can't happen if you want to be a championship quality team. Because oftentimes the excuse in circumstances like that is the youth of a team that's rebuilding and that. But the Grizzlies <laughs> are just, are as, just young. as young. Are as young as you are, right? Yeah. But also, and, and the reason why I knew Memphis would win this game, and Robert, you can speak to this. You talk about young people, young guys not really recognizing the moment. Minnesota had to have a team meeting <laughs> after, after the last game that they had. This, this is the playoffs. <laughs> you sh shouldn't need a meeting to.